Today, I'll be introducing you to my new car. So for anyone wondering why I have this Audi, because it is now my third car. In short, as of January, I'm gonna be doing a whole lot more miles. And to do those miles in the Jeep would cost me a fortune. And the Smart's just a bit too small to really make those journeys every day. Now, this car will give me the perfect blend of comfort and economy. And I've always liked the A3, so it's really good to finally have one. I particularly like this color, it's quite rare. It's meteor grey. Doesn't look like a metallic at times and it does look different colours in different lights. I think it's pearlescent, but I really like it. Now this car comes with so much history. I have got so many receipts with this car. Look at the thickness of that. All receipts, lots of Audi receipts in there, some independence. The service book is stamped pretty much every year. Lots of it's Audi. Again, a few independents in there, but really good history. And even better, the car has already had its dual mass flywheel and clutch replaced, and also its cam belt and water pump. So in terms of what this car needs, other than the really good clean, and I say I've done the interior, I've hoovered the, the carpets really thoroughly, I can't really clean the seats until the weather warms up, because it's freezing here at the moment. It was minus six last night, uh, and it's, it's bloody cold, and it's actually held me back in terms of cleaning the exterior, because any, any attempt at cleaning it and washing it is just going to result in me creating some sort of ice rink. I don't think uh, neighbours will be too impressed by that. But today is going to warm up. Uh, I'm going to service this car today. The spanner light is on. So I'm going to change the oil and filter, fuel filter, air filter, and also the pollen filter, and reset the service indicator. Upcoming jobs include a wheel bearing, it does have a, a new MOT on it this car, in fact the lady MOT'd it just before I bought it, uh, and it did have some advisories, it, the tyres are a bit low, uh, usual things, just misting to front shock absorbers, uh, not too worried about that, and a noisy offside front wheel bearing, uh, which you can hear slightly actually, there's a little bit of a drone, uh, just, it's only slight, but it's, uh, it's the wheel bearing. I've ordered that on Auto Dock. that's on its way. I've also ordered a set of front pads and discs, which I'm gonna do at the same time, because the discs um, are a bit lipped, and the pads, I reckon the pads are probably down to their last 10%, so uh, I'm gonna do those. Now, other than that, everything seems pretty good, although I'm bound to find things as I go along. There is just a small bit of body damage on the front. The lady said she uh, she had a parking lock of some description uh, and it's, it's pushed the wing in very slightly and, and torn the bumper on the corner here, as you can see, but I'm gonna get that fixed. Um, either I'll get a new bumper or I'll, I'll heat that up and, and make that good. I think that wing just needs pulling out a bit. It hasn't broken the paint or anything um, and, and it will look good as new. So that's it for today. Just a little introduction video on the Audi does mean that one of the other cars will probably have to go and something tells me that it's going to be this, the Smart. Watch this space. Hope you enjoyed the video. Once again, do feel free to like and subscribe. I'll see you in another video very soon.